This video aims to cover the grade point averages and how they're calculated at Florida State University. Let's first understand grade point averages, also known as your GPA. Your GPA can impact several aspects and opportunities available at FSU. This includes admission into a particular major, but this varies by major, keeping financial aid eligibility with scholarships such as Bright Futures, being recognized for the Dean's List or President's List. Dean's List requires a 3.5 GPA based on 12 credit hours attempted, and a President's List requires a 4.0 on at least 12 credit hours attempted. This also includes staying and even graduating from FSU, as a minimum of a 2.0 cumulative GPA is needed to stay in good academic standing and graduate from FSU. Now let's look at three different types of GPAs. Your FSU GPA is all of your grades earned at FSU. This is used to determine a student's academic standing at FSU. The transfer GPA reflects all grades earned at other institutions that count toward your degree. The overall GPA is a combination of your FSU and transfer GPA. This is used when looking at admission into a major and determining financial aid eligibility. Now let's understand calculating your grade point average. You can see here there's a sample schedule that consists of five courses, which totals out to be 13 credit hours for this term. We can see here the various grades assigned with each course. And then how we can get to a total of grade points is that we take the hours multiplied by the numerical equivalent associated with the grade, and that then reflects our grade points. So with the first course, we see here that this EAL1101 is a three credit hour course. The student earned a grade of a C plus. So we take three multiplied by 2.25, which is the numerical equivalent for a C plus, and we get to 6.75. We do that for each graded course, and we get to a total of 30 grade points. We can then take 30 grade points divided by 13 hours, and that will then give us a GPA. In summary, the numerical equivalent multiplied by the credit hours equals grade points. Term grade points divided by all attempted credit hours equals your GPA for the term, and all grade points divided by all attempted credit hours equals the student's cumulative or overall GPA. You can find your total grade points earned in Student Central by visiting my.fsu.edu, clicking on the Student Central icon, then the My Academics tile, then clicking on Academic Records, and then clicking View My Grades. If you're in the middle of a semester and you want to see how your potential term GPA could impact your cumulative GPA, you can calculate your grade point average with the FSU GPA calculator. Given this example, you could see here at the top that the student has taken 15 credits towards their GPA and has earned a previous total of 42 grade points, which gives them the current cumulative GPA of 2.8. Then the student can put in their current course schedule, the number of credit hours, and the grades they expect to earn, which will then calculate the total grade points for the particular term. And towards the bottom of the calculator, you will see what that term GPA will then look like, and then how that will impact the student's cumulative GPA. Thank you for watching, and have a great day.